Welcome back to my channel, you guys. You guys already know the drill. I'm about to do another wig review. Hello to you guys. Sorry for looking busted up, but it was like 4 a.m. and I was not about to be dolling up at this time. So, but I will say, of course. So the wig that I'm going to be reviewing is by What Lace Sensational Swiss Lace Wig, and the name is Audrey. This wig is a 13 by 6 lace front wig, and it ranges from $45 to $50. I got this wig in the color number one and apparently it says it's pre-customized unit. So we're about to see how customized this unit actually is. Here are all the colors that this wig could come in. So you choose what you want to choose. But we're going to go right ahead and open this wig and see what this wig is all about. So immediately pulling out this wig, I see that they came with a wig cap, which was boss because, you know, not a lot of wigs do that, like not even the other um, what laced wigs that I gotten came with the wig cap, unless they accidentally put them in there, but you know, I wasn't complaining, so we about to put this on my head in just a second. <laughs> So the first thing that I noticed when I was taking off this neck away from the hair is that this wig has some pretty tight curls, like that is super good. Um, usually all wigs should have tight curls, but I've seen a couple that did not. And then when I open it, it's just like a raggedy mess, but this was really tight so therefore when I run my fingers through it, it won't be a problem for a while. And the length was also pretty good too. So looks true to the picture this wig does come with baby hairs on the side pretty long baby hairs um, also does come with two clips on the side of your head and the nip of your neck to make sure that wig goes nowhere and some adjustable straps to make sure that wig is not leaving anywhere going anywhere whatsoever that is the lace in the front and it shows you basically where you can part Welcome back to my channel, you guys. It's been a super hot minute. Um, I apologize. I felt like I should come back with, you know, a little something different. So I did. And this is it. I don't know if you guys like. So I basically talked about this in the first clip, I believe. But um, the wig that I got is by What Lace Hairline Illusion Lace Wig. Um, her name is Audrey. Audrey. Here we go right there. I feel like every time I make a video, um, I lose my voice right before I make the video. So I apologize for my voice. But also, I just woke up and it's like, let's see what time it is. It's 7.07. I've been up since 2. As you already know, the wig came in this. Oh, where'd the piece go? Oh, we, it's gone. Um, my first impression of it is it was really, really cute. Really cute, curly. The waves were super tight. Yes, I did rub my fingers through this a couple of times. So now it's getting a little crazy, but it's okay. I like it crazy. I like how short and fun that looks. Way to come back, way to come back. So as you guys already know, I'm gonna be answering a couple of questions you guys might have about this unit. So if you guys wanna slay on a budget, <sighs> these are the videos for you. So the first question is the quality of the hair. I love the quality of the hair. Obviously it's synthetic, so you know, they can only do so much for you, but for the quality that I got, you know, I love it. I really do love it. It's really cute. 
don't feel too cheap. Is it true to length? I feel like it is very true to length. On the box it shows it's basically up to the girl's shoulder. And it looks like it's up to mine. There we go. And here we go. Tangle free. Is it tangle free? So far, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So far, yes. But I just literally applied it. So maybe ask me a week from now. It might not be so. My head itching a little bit. Oh. But for right now, it's tangle free. Usually the shorter hair is like, you know, the least tangle. What's the word? Not tanglish, but it it doesn't tangle that much because it's not long. Like as soon as by the time it tangles, I'm already at the end. See? I'm coming out the the hair. So the shedding on this hair, let's see. Let's see. Ooh. Got him. Alright, let's see. A one, a two. Hmm. Nothing. Now I think it's shedding because when I went to go take off the um one second. When I went to go take off the card, like off the wig, I cut it, but I cut some of the hair too. So that's probably why I'm not trying to give this wig excuses. But, um, you know, I'm just saying it's probably why it's shedding. There's really not much to say about this unit. I like how basically you can flip it whichever way you want. So you can one, have it this way if you like. And then you can have it this way. I think you can do parts in there too, but I don't really like the parts in this one, so I feel like short hair, you should be able to just swish it to whatever side you like, but and as you guys know, I basically tried to keep this super simple for you guys, so basically a beginner can be able to install this, so I don't do any plucking, any baby hairs or anything whatsoever. So the way that you see it on my head is the way it's probably going to look on your head as soon as you install it. This is really fun hair. Something I also do like about this hair is the volume in it. It has so much volume. I love when it's not flat, but then again, you know, usually all curly hair should not be flat. But you'd be surprised. You'd be surprised. Let me stop brushing my fingers through this hair before I really get bushy and crazy. Yeah, I don't feel like it. I really love this. I love this unit. Just to let you guys know, the installing process was pretty good. It was pretty easy, pretty simple to me. Um, uh, basically, I feel I don't feel like though it's big head friendly. Um, because it's a little tight on this, but like I, my, I feel like my head now, I'm not going to say just made it, but it kind of just made it. So, you know, but if you have a bigger head than mine, I'm not sure how that would work. I think you'd be able to figure it out, but it might be a little bit tight. Cause when I was putting this on, that's basically the only con. It was a little, getting a little tight and then I had to push it more on my forehead. And then I was like, okay, that works. But what if you don't want your hair on your forehead? What if you want it on your hairline? So, no, it's a bushy hot mess, but I like it, so it's okay. So basically, any pros, basically my pros are, I love the pattern. It's a really cute, curly, you know, like a date night vibe curl. Another pro is that I love the length. It's not too long. It's not too short. It's the right in between so you can be able to, you know, switch it up. It's not like a bob, but it's like long enough to, you know, cover them shoulders. Um, another pro I think is the color of the hair. 
I love the color of the hair. It's very true to color. Like I said in multiple videos of mine that usually sometimes when I get hair, it says it's number one, but somehow in the light it looks like a number um, two or well, maybe a three. That actually happened one time. It said number one in the box and it ended up being looking like a three. So I was I was really concerned. But let me turn up this lighting so you guys can see that it's true to color. And any cons, basically my only con is applying the wig. It's a little tough. It like I don't know if it's just because I do have a big head, but it's a little tight on the side, so I had to push it more on my forehead. But you know, I guess it looks okay like that. Like I guess it's the way it should be, huh? It's gonna be up to you guys whenever you guys try it. Maybe I should let you guys know the price just in case you guys are wondering. And of course, I always have to search it up because just to let you guys know, I buy my wigs in bulk. So I buy a bunch of them at one time and then I forget how much they all cost. So I'm gonna search it up right now, as always. Okay, so you can basically find it anywhere between $45 and $50 for a synthetic unit. I would definitely buy this again in a different color and multiple different colors in every color possible because it's a good go-to short wig if you just you don't wanna you don't wanna do too much but you don't want to do too little so if you guys have any more questions or if you guys have any concerns or any you know add-ons or anything that you guys would like to say you can basically most definitely let me know down in the comments below. Follow my social media platforms. My Instagram is Krista Kelly underscore and my Snapchat is CSDKAA. And if you're feeling this, then basically I say get your one. Get your one. And I'll see you guys in my next video.